So here I am at the Hyundai press conference in LA and they made some really big, very bold announcements, not just showing the new Santa Fe here, as you can see, but they also announced that starting next year that you will be able to buy Hyundai products directly from Amazon. That's right, you heard it correctly. They have a new collaboration with Amazon and you can go onto the Amazon special website and buy all the Hyundai products and order it through their system, at least for the US market. So that's uh, shockingly big news and uh, that's something that was unexpected. But we are also very excited to see the Santa Fe here. Uh, as you can tell, it's a bold design that perhaps only Hyundai or Koreans would dare do compared to a more conservative Toyota uh, or Honda or Nissan designers. I think Hyundai have learned to take a huge risk and it's paying, it's paying off because they're making some really great progress in terms of design, engineering, and just performance overall. So here's the Santa Fe. It's a little a bit of a controversial rear design. I think that's something that is going to need a little bit of um, getting used to. But everything else about the Santa Fe is pretty shockingly beautiful. It looks a bit like a Land Rover Defender. It's hard to get close by right now. There's a lot of people, but the front design is unique, kind of geometric, I guess. You see lots of blocky designs. And uh, while people are watching, let me do a quick prototype inspection for uh, supposedly prototype. I cannot believe how good the grain of the paint is but also how good the panel fit is i can't use my tool here but this looks like around three millimeter actually and the panel fit looks excellent almost perfect even the curvature here looks really good so so far the quality of the uh, panel alignment looks really good this paint job is actually beautiful and i'm going to just take a quick look inside here fight the crowd it's got a new curved screen here and uh, the interior maybe is not as innovative but still really good side bolster here quite a bit more than on average uh, SUV of this size dual um, charger wireless charger and very roomy interior as well so let me move away so I can continue to film here a little bit let me take you to the other one so this is the Santa Fe XRT which is the off-road version with the off-road tires right here and I have to go over there for the Santa Fe calligraphy which is the uh, kind of premium high-end version the luxury version as well there's a lot of excitement here at LA Auto Show with a Hyundai product much more than I expected because there's a huge crowd here and people are really excited about Santa Fe so this is calligraphy blackout trims beautiful and a semi matte copper finish again looks good in terms of the panel gap panel alignment um, these are prototypes so maybe not fair to measure the quality or check the quality but inside looks good too big panel big, cur big curved panel here once again the seats are really contoured kind of surprising to me most SUV in this class has a pretty flat seat but this one the side bolster comes out quite a bit even the bottom part too allowing for much supportive feel when you're driving around the curvy road I'm doing this uh, kind of live stream style so hopefully you guys don't mind the casual nature here's the second row of seat also pretty roomy and seats can obviously fold and move in the third seats back there so this is the calligraphy you can actually open this part that uh, this person is doing as a kind of grab handle i think so that's oh he's gonna show us oh i see you step on here you grab onto here so you can climb up so it's kind of a hidden door hidden in here so you can just basically just push it and use it as a grab handle so that's very unique design and once again the back of this vehicle is the most unique aspect in the sense of the design blocky design pretty good room actually even with a third row up decent some storage on the bottom as you can see when you roll down the third seat lots of space 
very flat, pretty wide as well. They keep saying the rear cargo area is very important because it's really meant to be like um, a livable space to be used and enjoyed in outdoor, for example. So they don't want this to be just a cargo space. And that's why there's so much emphasis on making this space very roomy and flat and easy to use. So yeah, so this is the Calligraphy Santa Fe. And one more time, on the other side is the Santa Fe XRT, which is the off-road version. Very packed audience here. They're really busy, but uh, what a great job that Honda has done with the press conference. Toyota doesn't even have a press conference here today because they did this a couple days ago. And so they're not doing anything at the show. But let me finish off by just showing the design of the Santa Fe. I love the exterior design. I'm not too crazy about the back end, but really like what they've done with uh, Santa Fe. It's definitely a um, head turner in terms of the exterior design anyways. And so far the quality looks very good as well. And it should sell like hotcakes because it's roomy and great design and could give a good run for other popular SUVs in this price range. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Coming live from LA Auto Show, signing off for now. Thank you so much, guys.